it is me. Um, I wanted to come on and do a quick message for someone out there. Um, I don't know. I've just been bored. Uh, I, I don't know. I've just been like, not lonely lately, but just like, I don't know. It's been a lot of like preparation and getting ready for everything because things are like shifting. It's turning, it's fall now and stuff, you know. So I'm just like going with the flow on things. Um, okay, so. Whoever you are, you may be a Libra, or you may have Libra in your chart somewhere, or you may be dealing with a Libra. Um, you're juggling something. There's something you're juggling that you don't want to let go of. This is something that you have been waiting on for a very long time. This has required a lot of strength on your part. But you're not going to stay um, in this energy of like juggling anymore. You're moving past this, whoever you are. You may be a king of cups or this may be a king of cups that you're dealing with or that you're juggling. Meaning this could be a water sign. You may be a water sign. You may be an air sign. You may be an earth sign. Meaning a hell of a lot of earth in here. Um, whoever you are, something that you have been working on though. You've been working on this situation for a long time, whatever this is, trying to gain whatever it is that you thought you deserved out of this. And it's been like causing you to carry a lot of burdens, okay? Um, you're needing to heal from this situation. You're needing to heal from whatever it was that you was working on that hasn't panned out. Okay, this this is something you need to heal from. Because you have a new beginning coming. You may have been bound up confused about like where this new beginning is or where it's going or just where you're going in general. But you need to trust in your intuition, okay? Because you're going to be led into some kind of soul tribe that you have or some kind of family. Yeah. And you're going to be very, like, materialistically, like, you're going to be good in that aspect as well. Yeah, because you're moving away from something. You've stepped into your emperor energy, okay? Um, there may be things that you know about that you're not telling others or you may be being very mysterious or secretive at this time, whoever you are. Yeah. Judgment's been called that you're supposed to do something on your own or you're supposed to focus on something on your own or you're not supposed to collaborate with whoever you were collaborating with or whatever you were working on that didn't pan out. You have something else that is going to pan out. I don't know. It's like you were working on this thing waiting for it to pan out, but there's something different that's about to pan out for you. I don't know what that means, but it's for someone. Okay, because you're a truth teller. You may be um, a divination reader or... You may know about tarot and understand things about tarot. Sun is all in my eyes. Let's see if I can turn. I didn't do shit. Okay, um, whoever you are, you're mourning because you feel like you've missed out on your blessing, but you actually are about to get some kind of blessing that you did not know was coming. Okay, this is something that has been secretive, like kept a secret from you. Um. You were working on one thing, but you're about to get a payout from another thing. I don't know. It's about to be a new beginning. Someone's going to come in with some kind of communication, some kind of truth, okay, that's going to lead you into this new beginning, and you're going to start planning because wherever you're at right now, you're not happy. You may be surrounded by people that are ungrateful or people that are not, like, appreciative of you or don't, like, give back to you. You're going to move away from whoever these people are, whoever this community is or whatever. Yeah, you're going to, like... Someone's going to give you some kind of, like, information or some kind of, like, news, and it's going to be very exciting for you, okay? You've been nurturing this, but there's been some kind of jealous-ass energy in the background that's been trying to stop this for you. It's been some jealous person in the background that's been trying to stop whatever you've been trying to nurture, okay? But it's destined that you have whatever community and whatever, like, um, victory this is, okay? You're supposed to have some kind of victory with some kind of community, okay? You're supposed to step into your soul tribe here somehow. Um, because they're watching you, whoever they are, they're meditating on you. Um, there may have been someone in the background that was trying to cause some kind of illusions on your, like, to make people think badly of you or think that you were something you were not. Um, you're very stable right now, but you're also very fiery. You're grounded, but you're also, like, ready to fight if necessary, whoever you are. Because you want an equal give and take. You're tired of being bound up. You're tired of this shit. Someone is, like... Someone is, whoever this, like, jealous-ass energy, 
is trying to come back into your life. I don't know if this is a friend or who this is. But they're trying to like message you and communicate with you because they feel bad for whatever they have done. Okay? This person is afraid that they're about to get their karma. And it's worrying this person. This person may have medical issues as well. This person wants to offer an apology to you because this person wants to manifest you back into their life. But this person was a third party to you, okay? This person may have wanted who you were with or this person may have wanted to be you in some way. This person is untrustworthy, okay? You need to end whatever collaboration this was with this person. And you need to go forward on your own, whoever you are. Yeah, because you're an empress, whoever you are. You're like, um, very abundant. Yeah, I'm telling you, something that you have been working on is going to pay off. In a way that you did not expect it to pay off, okay? Your intuition may be leading and guiding you, showing you that this is going to pay off for you. Um, because someone someone is going to bring something in for you, okay? Whoever this is may have feelings for you as well. I'm not sure. But they are a very strategic person. This is going to be a tower when you find out who this person is. That's going to offer whatever this is to you. This person may have a lot of love for you. And this person may have seen that you've been backstabbed by exes or something. I don't know. Something about your ex. This person may know your ex. Or this person may know that you've been backstabbed from your ex. This person knows you're very paranoid right now. And you're you're very isolated. That's the truth. This person feels like you're meant to come out of that. And you're meant to be like their partner or with them. This person may want to legally contract you into something. I don't know what that is. But it may be business wise. I'm not sure. Whoever you are, you're walking away from a heartbreak. Because that person was energetically fighting you behind the scenes. And you didn't realize this. Um... But the angels have helped guide you out of this. You're a very loving person. You've been having to stand your guard over shit. But you've won a victory and you closed out some kind of cycle that's supposed to be closed out for you, okay? And that was like all my cards. But that's like, sorry. That's like what it is. Um, I think I want to do some of my like shaman cards or whatever. I don't remember exactly what they're called. They're called shaman something. Shaman dream or something. I don't know point is whoever you are you're gonna get something that you didn't expect okay straddling worlds wandering between realms whoever you are you're very spiritual you can feel this coming energetically but you don't know exactly what it is whoever you are <clears throat> yeah you're about to get some kind of help from someone some kind of benefactor that's going to increase your your possibilities increase your opportunities okay i don't know who this person is but this person wants to help you in some way yeah this person feels very close to you whoever this is this person may watch you or I don't know. I don't know if you know this person or not, but this person wants to bring opportunities into your life. Yeah. This person wants to group think with you. This person thinks you're very intelligent. This person thinks you're very tapped in. Okay. Yeah. Intentionality. This person is not being honest about their intentions with you or they're not letting it be known yet. Yeah. The Divine Matrix. But you feel this person. You know this person is around or you know this person is trying to help you. Yeah. Time to replenish. Right now you're, you're like getting over this heartbreak shit that you've been going through and this person knows that so this person is giving like you space right now yeah because this person knows that you need direction this person may be trying to guide you in some way as well i'm not sure how they may be praying for you they may be like you may see them as well i'm not sure the universe is your partner bold step forward yeah god is going to help you like with this helping hand person this person's going to come in and help you out in some way it's like a helping hand like sent from god yeah, resonating. You resonate with this person's soul, or this person resonates with your soul. This person understands you in some way. This person knows you're moving out of stagnation and you're moving into bigger and like better shit. Yeah, that's the truth. Someone knows that you're moving into change and they know that you're about to have something better in your life. I don't know what exactly information they have that you don't, but this person, this person feels like left out in the cold. This person feels like a third party. This person yeah is adapting to the fact that they can't be with you yet or they can't talk to you yet this person knows that you're very defensive right now because you have been in this like paranoid state about all these other fuckers okay this person feels like you're not getting what you deserve right now this person feels like you're not surrounded by people that want good things for you this person feels like you're surrounded by people that upset you yeah forgiveness they know you're having to forgive people right now and connect with people again this person is trying to help you protect your future in some way. This person knows something that you don't know, okay? This person knows there's some kind of sacred contract between you two. And this person knows that you're supposed to gather together and be together. You're supposed to be, like, help for others. Like, they're supposed to help you, but then you're supposed to help others with them. Yeah, gathering around. There's something about a community. Beloved, this person wants to, like, create a community with you or be in a community with you or help build your community or something. I don't know. But this person is a benefactor. 
this person is like it, this person has a soul contract with you this person doesn't know exactly how to approach you because you're very like people don't know your next moves like you're very unpredictable whoever you are and this person doesn't know exactly how to move forward to you but this person wants to and this person wants to gather around with you and like group think this person wants to think with you this person intellectually understands you in some way yeah it's something about the web they're watching you on the web or you're watching them on the web okay but all right i love you guys very much i just wanted to get on and do this read for someone and um yeah i love you guys very much i will be back on later okay okay bye